Good morning, everyone. Deb and Tattoo here, Fairport, New York. How are you today? Happy Thursday. Um, I have a special treat today. Hey, hey. Hey, hey, this is Michael Schwartz. He is from WAM 13. He's running with me today so that we can all talk a little bit more and raise the awareness about cancer. Whoop, can I rotate phone? I tried to get creative, guys. This woman is amazing. She's my hero. My hero. So let's talk about another hero, shall we? So Michael's best friend from college, guys, he passed away in 2019 um, after a fierce battle with leukemia. He and Mike, the Mike Square, we'll call them. That's exactly right. Mike Square, they met down at Ithaca College. They were roommates from the very first day and became like brothers. Guys, they went through everything that college can throw at you. They did it together. And shortly after graduation, his best friend, Mike Square, found out that he had leukemia. And you know what? That has got to be, like, think about that moment in his life. He graduated college accomplishing everything that he wanted to, and he was given the message that he had leukemia. This guy by his side for the next two years, two bone marrow transplants, held his hand and went through all of that with him. They had to say goodbye to each other um, in 2019. And today, every step that we take, we're taking it for him. This guy right here, guys, we're doing the hill today. We are gonna do the hill. And I told him that Michael will be on our shoulders. He will be our angel. And we will be stepping for him and uh, sending it all up to him. So guys, I invite you to uh, please join me in my run, join me in my fundraiser. And I'm gonna give Mike the uh, camera because he's a much better reporter than I. No, that was, <laughs> that was perfect. That was beautiful. We're, uh, we're running, I'm just gonna stop for one second. We're, we're running this and we're running it the whole morning on Good Day Rochester. We're right now in Fox Rochester. Uh, 7.30, you're gonna hear from this amazing woman of why she's doing it. But without a doubt, her story took me in how she's fighting and raising awareness from her experiences, giving back to others. Uh, there's a lot of feelings that I can't explain uh, unless you're here on this view with the sun coming up, the snow, the hill, the, hell. the thoughts of those people who are battling. And I was blown away really when you said we're gonna honor we are. my best friend because I know you honor someone each and every day. And I just want to show you, by the way, my socks. I want to stop for one second. World Cancer Day. Today is World Cancer Day. These are my Stop Out Cancer Socks. It's a nonprofit that I'm involved in uh, back from Binghamton because we we have to stock out cancer until we don't have to anymore. Yep. There's amazing people that are being stricken with this awful disease and their families. And it's not just a sickness, physicality. It's it's a nightmare. It's horrific. So please know your body, be there for others, and let's raise awareness and raise funds. One project right here, this amazing woman, 2021 miles. We can go from Rochester to Las Vegas. Yep. And I'm thinking about the time that I went with Mike, my best friend, to Vegas. Oh my gosh. Break. And uh, it was a little warmer than this. A little warmer? But, uh, you know, we're, we're that uh, I feel him with us today. And uh, through your motivation, through your inspiration, I hope to uh, help inspire others by sharing her story yep. uh, because she is amazing. And I thank you guys for listening. But we're going to get ready for Good Day Rochester. That's coming up at 730. Uh, yep. Just an amazing woman. And uh, to all those who have fought cancer, the loved ones, the loved ones who have gone through heartbreak, I pray each and every day that your heart is mended together as close as possible. Uh, the broken heart may never be fixed, but I pray that it's mended together as close as possible. Yep. Uh, and we are thinking of you always in our thoughts and prayers. Uh, and this is the least we could do. The least. The so least guys, I want to share with you, we started with the moon and look at, we got the sun look coming up. Sun. It's a beautiful day. Look at this guy. Look at this guy. He's going and we are heading to the Whitney Hill. Nate, I think you're watching. Um, we got to get ready for air. Oh my gosh. So we got to say goodbye. There he is. Look at, he's running. We're, running. We're going. And uh, we got Tattoo with us. Look at him. He's like, let's get moving, mom. It's time. So um, catch us on 
Fox Rochester, and thank you for your support. Nate, Carla, Valerie, Elizabeth, everybody. And go on, by the way, go on Fox Rock, go on Fox Rochester, share the link for Deb's story so more people could see it. There's a link to donate to her fundraiser. <sighs> He's the best reporter ever, huh? You guys are gonna miss him tomorrow when I go live again. I love you all. See you. Bye-bye.